Learn everything about our resisto door and window membranes. Let's get started. Presentation plan. We will start with a brief description of resisto. Next, we will explain why it's important to install a bituminous waterproofing membrane before installing a window. Later, we will present our membranes and describe how to install them. We will finish our presentation by giving you some expert advice. Who are we? Resisto has specialized in the retail of construction and renovation products since 1996. Why should you install a bituminous membrane around doors and windows? Let's think about it. Reason 1. Vulnerability to water infiltration. Because of their installation method and the complexity of the elements they are made of, doors and windows are usually more vulnerable to water infiltration. Since water and moisture penetration can damage the structure, cladding, and other components of the building, infiltration risks must be controlled and all stagnant water must be avoided. Reason 2. Compliance with Building Code Standards The Standard To minimize any damage to a building caused by weather, flexible and rigid flashings should be made of waterproof materials that are firmly attached before the exterior wall cladding is installed. Flashings must be integrated into the building's weather barrier membrane in accordance with the applicable building code. Acceptable flashing materials are the following. Reinforced bitumen, rigid metal containing aluminum, galvanized metal, factory processed non-ferrous metal, we would like to introduce our two high-performance bituminous membranes. The Red Zone 25 air vapor barrier is the cost-saving solution. It is 0.635 mm or 0.025 inches thick and is mostly used around doors, windows and for construction details. The Red Zone air vapor barrier, on the other hand, is the professional solution. It is 1 mm or 0.040 inches thick and can be applied both around doors and windows and on the roof. Here are our Resisto Membranes features. Self-sealing around screws and nails. Maintains the same features and flexibility at low temperatures, below minus 10 degrees Celsius. Resists against UV rays for 90 days. Furthermore, they adhere to most materials. Compatible substrates. OSB, plywood, concrete, outdoor gypsum, polystyrene panels. Now, let's discover the installation guide step by step. On a surface with a minimum slope of 6%, use the Resisto exterior primer if required and install the red zone corners in the bottom corners. Apply a red zone strip on the lower part of the window and cover 5 to 7.5 centimeters from the weather barrier. Cut the membrane on each side of the opening and adhere it with a membrane roller. Install a membrane strip from 5 to 7.5 centimeters on the weather barrier of the joist. Cover the entire interior joist. Repeat this step on the other joist. Lift the upper weather barrier. Adhere a membrane strip to cover the upper part of the window. The membrane must be wide enough to leave about 2.5 extra centimeters in the opening. Now, the window can be inserted. Once the window is in place, install the metal flashing according to the building code. Then, fold the weather barrier in place and cut 2.5 centimeters of it to clear the metal flashing. Apply a membrane strip on the weather barrier and metal flashing to ensure the vapor barrier continuity. Finally, seal the metal flashing corners by installing a membrane strip obliquely on each end. Don't forget to use the membrane roller on the membrane. And that's how it's done! You will see an overview of every step in this short installation video.
As you just saw, our membranes for doors and windows are very easy to use. Nonetheless, here are some tips. Professional tips you won't forget. Using a primer before installing the membrane offers superior adhesion. A primer is mandatory when the membrane is used for roof details or on the foundation as a transition membrane. Using a membrane roller to apply pressure on the membrane results in good adherence over the entire surface. Condition the rolls at 10 degrees Celsius or more before the installation if the outside temperature is below 10 degrees Celsius. Cover the membrane within 90 days following the installation. A primer is required if the membrane remains exposed for more than 24 hours. With Resisto Corners and Membranes, waterproofing is right around the corner. For more information and to access our documentation, visit our website www.resisto.ca